Hello friends, it's Shara. Thanks for stopping by. We have a box opening. Now I have not had a box opening in over three months, which is like some kind of record for me. I think I haven't gone more than a month before without a box opening. So maybe I'm making progress. <laughs> And I did want to let everyone know that I am going to make a sales video probably today as well because I am selling several babies from my collection. But first, we are going to open this girl and I will change her into something pink for on Wednesdays we wear pink. And this is a girl. And the only doll that I have sold that I regretted was this kit. Now this isn't the same doll, but it is the same kit. And I don't know how I'm gonna feel once I see the baby. Maybe I'll decide to sell her, but um, I am really focused on getting my collection trimmed down. I'm feeling claustrophobic and I need to do something, but let's enjoy the box opening and then changing this sweet baby into something pink. So here we go. Now she came with goodies. She is a pre-loved baby. Let's get this first. Oh, it smells lovely. Came with a really cute little Nook Minnie Mouse pacifier, pink with um, pink, white, and teal stripes. Very cute. And a beautiful headband with pink and coral color florals. Very pretty. A little bunny diaper that is so tiny, I don't think this will fit this baby. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, and there is a pacifier clip. It's peach and sort of a taupe with little pink and gray and white arrows. And then, oh, this is so cute. A little tulle headband with gold um, accents, sparkly gold, and then little white flowers with gold centers. Very cute. I love these kind on this. I think all headbands are coming that way now. All right, and she sent clothes. Oh my gosh, there's quite a bit in here. Oh, she came with something kind of pink. Oh, some little socks. How cute, the little Laura Ashley pink and white socks with pink polka dots, and they're super tiny, super cute. Oh, a beautiful, um, I think it's one of those rompers that can turn into a gown. It's by Vera Bradley Baby, and it's in this gorgeous jewel-toned butterflies in lime green and grass green and fuchsia very beautiful. It's got a beautiful um, embroidered detail down the front and then the bottom is ruffled but you can see that it would snap to make a romper as well I'm pretty sure yeah because there are snaps in the back so it can be a romper or a sleeper or a gown. Very cute. Oh yeah I can put this on baby. This is sort of a peachy light pink, and it says Minnie Mouse down. Their little pants, they have the little front kangaroo pockets. Super cute, little drawstring. I think that's a little mock drawstring. Very sweet. This is by Disney Baby, and it's a size zero to three months. And then, look at this. Oh my gosh. Well, first off, it's a hoodie. And it has a little bow in the light pink with white polka dots. And then it has Minnie Mouse ears. It's white with black polka dots on the inside. And then it has a black outline of Minnie Mouse over the chest, over the, the heart. 
and then um, it doesn't have the pocket. The pockets are on the pants and a little waistband. Super cute. I think I'll put that on her. I had brought this out, um, but that outfit, it's chilly here today, overcast and rainy, so I was going to put her in a comfy sleeper, but uh, maybe I'll put her in the little Minnie Mouse outfit instead. Okay, so we are two baby, and I will get her out laying on the changing table, and we will open her up. One second. Okay, here she is. She's in a beautiful um, sort of a teal blue blankie. It says... Um, baby and bear's nursery on it and it's tied with a little satin ribbon she does not have a cover on her face we'll start from the bottom oh she's wearing something pink oh look at those little feet cute little pink socks with a rose pink trim look at that chubby foot you may recognize the sculpt. It is a bountiful baby sculpt. She is a real born. And I don't have any real borns in my collection. I tend not to care much for the limbs of the real borns, but this one is an exception. In fact, she's one of my favorite kits of all. Look at that chubby foot chubby 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 now this one is a little different than the one i had the one i had um the arms had been replaced the um this baby is three quarter arms and it was replaced with the full um limb or full arm baby so i actually have never seen this actual kit's limbs Little chubby hands. Both of them are splayed open. Very cute. They remind me, this one reminds me a lot of the August sculpt. But you can see it's very nice. It's very overcast here today, but I think she's coming off well. All right. She moves beautifully. And that is in part to the uh, three quarter arms, but her legs move very well as well super cute okay here we go oh my goodness oh my goodness let's get this hat off you little baby girl if you recognize her she is the spice real born by bountiful baby and she is a chubby girl look at that double chin she has pierced ears and a gorgeous head of painted hair look at this wow oh she is darling oh my goodness baby girl you're so pretty yes you are oh isn't she gorgeous i have to pick her up hold on one second i think i won't change her guys she looks so cute in this little outfit and it has the tag on and it's still brand new i think i'll keep her in this look at her little face look at this she is so adorable she has a double chin just like her mom just like her mama. Oh, that hair is incredible. Super adorable. Ooh. It's a cute little outfit. It says, I don't know what that says. Catamine? Catamine? It's a very sweet little uh, romper. Um, with a little undershirt and a cute little um, Peter Pan collar shirt embroidered on the edge. And it's got some applique and embroidery flowers on her right leg. And the little um, straps for the romper are ribbons and they come through with a little knot. And it's in this very pretty, pretty pink. 
Oh, she is darling. I just love her. Oh my goodness. You are such a pretty girl. Let's find your new new. Where did I put that? Where, there it is. Where is your new new? Oh, look how sweet. Oh my gosh, she is darling. Yeah, I don't think she's gonna be going anywhere, at least not, not right now, because she is adorable. And my previous spice, um, I mean, I kept her in my bed. She was so wonderful to snuggle, and I think this one's even more snuggly because of the three-quarter arms. It makes her arms move out of the way so she can really be snuggled. Gosh, she has such a beautiful face. Look at those beautiful eyebrows. She is beautiful. Oh, I'm so pleased with her. So I don't know who her artist is offhand, but she came from a reputable seller and she didn't come with any paperwork, but I'm assured she is authentic and I'm not worried in the least. Oh, she's darling. So instead of changing her because she is all dressed for the occasion and wearing pink as it is Wednesday, and we know on Wednesdays we wear pink, so she came appropriately. And I will go ahead and start bringing babies out that I am going to be selling and I'll just lay them down on the changing table. I'll let you have a look. I'll explain what kit they are and who their artist is if I have that information. I'm not gonna be going into the details. If you are interested, let me know and we can discuss it, but I will give you the kit names. I won't give you the names I've given them. It gets too confusing. So I'll just give you their kit name and their artist and we can talk further if you are interested in talking further <laughs> and maybe adopting one of my gorgeous babies. So, all right, friends, well, I will bring babies on and we will uh, go from there. All right, hold on. So I'm gonna bring the babies on in what they were wearing when I left for New Zealand. So some of them may be in Christmas attire and they had their hair covered and they were covered with a blanket the whole time I was gone. So this is the Sandy Sculpt by Joanna Kazmerzak. She was reborn by Alexandra Taylor Hughes and she used to belong to Suzanne at Suzanne's Babies. And she is beautiful. She has this beautiful sort of strawberries and cream um, complexion. She has deep blue eyes and really gorgeous ginger hair. It is so incredibly soft and rooted beautifully. And it has a little bit of a curl. It's in this little bob and she is so cute. Like I said, her hair was covered with plastic, so she has a bit of, but you can see the gorgeous curls that pop right up if you spritz it with, with um, distilled water. She is absolutely beautiful. So this is baby number one. All right, I will bring on the next baby. So next we have the Vivian Sculpt by Sandy Faber and he was reborn by a wonderful artist on ebay and he has this amazing head of hair rooted beautifully it's so soft and it can curl up so well so beautiful he has rooted eyebrows that have been um, permanently sealed so they look three-dimensional but they don't go wayward and of course he has that gorgeous Vivian smile so he is also for sale his paint work is amazing he has such a gorgeous ethnic skin tone and I just love him he will make someone very happy he's very cuddly um, but I have two Vivian sculpts, and it's time for me to part with one. 
Oh my gosh, he's so cute. I gotta quit looking at him. All right, hold on for the next baby. And the final baby I'm going to show today is the Aria Sculpt by Ping Lao, and she was done by the amazing Palm View Reborns. And she is absolutely gorgeous. You can see that painted hair is incredible. She is a cuddle baby. Do you, I don't know if you can see the hair with the glare. She has the most amazing three-dimensional hair. So she is a cuddle baby. She has cloth limbs. She was stuffed at my request to be very firm, more like a teddy bear, um, so that she can sit up. She sits up beautifully, and she is just adorable with that gorgeous, gorgeous mouth. She takes a cut pacifier I don't even know if she has a magnet. I, I don't think so. I've always put a cut pacifier in her mouth. And she is really cute. Her eyelashes are amazing. Her hair is amazing. She is really beautiful. All right, so that is the last of the babies I'm gonna show today. I will be bringing some more on either later this week or next week and hopefully I will get through the selling process um, and get to making you know more fun videos because <laughs> these aren't fun for me I don't you know I don't necessarily enjoy selling babies <laughs> but it is a necessity when you have such a large collection all right friends well sweet Gertie here is all dressed for Wednesday as well, so it's appropriate for us to uh, sign out with a view of her. She looks gorgeous. Let's look at your aunties and uncles, and maybe your new mommy. All right, friends, thanks for coming by and seeing my new baby girl, and if you're interested in any of the babies that I've shown you today, or possibly someone that you may wish to purchase you can contact me in one of the links below either my instagram my facebook or my email please only use those links i i don't want you to get to somebody that's not me so use the links that i provide and i can let you know if a baby you may be interested in is for sale um, but i will be bringing some more on and feel free to contact me all right, friends, as always, we are sending you wishes of love and light, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.